Hey guys, so today I'm doing a, another GTA video where I'm going to customize one of the new, well, the new car that got added um, to Legendary Motorsport Net. Now before you say anything, I know that my Ferrari ended up looking, it looks kind of nice but it, not many people liked how it looked. Um, it has actually been changed a bit because I took a look at it and I was like, yeah, it does look a bit bit strange. Um, so I'll show that probably in a minute when I go to get my new car. But the new car customising is based on a Spiker C8 Aileron, I think you pronounce it. Or it might, it's also kind of based on an Aston Martin DB9. It, it's kind of a mix of the two. It's called the Visor Neo. Now, this is a beautiful car. It's like the Spiker C8 which is obviously what I've just said is one of the cars it's based on. It's one of my favourite looking cars ever because it's just a beautiful car and like just look at the thing. So I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to just order it in black for now. And um, oh yeah, I sold a lot of my apartments and stuff uh, for money and stuff so I'm going to put it in my arena workshop. If you're wondering how I made all this money, well I'm now on 268k but it wasn't like 2 million a minute ago. I made it from um, thingy. I made it from doing a like a thing with the casino, which I'll show you um, at some point probably. Uh, although it might get like changed, I'm not sure. Anyways, um, I'll see you when we're at the casino and the I mean not at the casino when we're at the arena workshop and the cars arrived. Two hours later. Okay guys, so the Neo has just arrived and it's absolutely beautiful. Ooh, look at the back of it. Oh, this is a beautiful car. I like this. Although before I get in that and take places, I will just quickly show you my new and improved Ferrari. So we've now got no yellow stripe. We've got white as the secondary color to match the wheel walls. Uh, we've got red wheels. We've got nice white. Um, wing wears and I think it should let me just um, quickly do this yeah look we've got a red underglow on there so it's pretty beautiful okay now what's pretty cool is because I've got all these delivered to my arena workshop I don't actually have to go and drive to LSC to customize my new visor Neo I can just straight up customize it here although I would like to take it for a drive so I am like I would like to test out how it drives and stuff. So I am actually going to drive that, and I like how the corner, the corners of the headlights. I'm actually going to drive all the way up to this one because I like to take it for a drive. Let's just oh god, any other crash already? Let's just listen to the engine. That is pretty nice. Can we get a? Can we get a backfire? There we go. Backfire out the exhaust, and we've got some like lights when you're a burst out. Right, let's get going. See how it drives. Okay, I'm liking the handling. The car feels quite heavy, but like a nice heavy. I mean, it's not perfect the handling, but it's pretty nice. I'd say it's better than uh, the Ferrari and the Thrats. I wouldn't say it's better than, say, like, the NS Paragon R, though. Okay, no, this car can flip cars above it. Although, maybe that's just lucky because it was spinning out at high speed. Yeah, this thing is definitely um, handles nicer than the Ferrari and the Thrax. Or at least, in my opinion. But uh, I would say the NS Paragon R handles better than it. Because although there's not loads and loads of variation of handling on cars, uh, like the Crew 2 in this game, there is quite a lot of different um, thingy. Quite a lot of different ways you can handle um, cars. Okay, right, let's get the car repaired. And now I've already got an idea for what I want to do with this, right? So I'll stick on all the upgrades. Oh, okay. That, that's nice to put. Oh, I like that. Okay, so for now, I will just do that. I estimated about um, a thousand. I mean, a hundred thousand for the uh, like 
general sort of um, thingy. What's it called? Like actual upgrades to performance, and it was about right ish. So, anyway, now let's work on the customization of the car. Bumper, it's the front bumper. Okay, they're all kind of. Actually, no, because the colours won't show up, so I'll change the colours first. I already know what I'm having this for primary. Um, we're going to do a. This is the one that I've not tried yet, but I imagine it'll look amazing. I'm going to do a matte dark red and then we we'll hover over black for a bit. Okay, then we're going to go plate. I'm going to change it. No, that's the wrong thing. Let's play for color, for lesson. And then we're going to find a bright red color. I think it is. Oh no, actually, I think it's a type of pink. It's that. No, that's not it. Was it some pink? Nope. It was a red, wasn't it, actually? Serena Red, look, it creates like a velvety effect on the car. It looks amazing. Yeah, look at that. Right, we'll have that on it. We're not 79k, but that's okay. So I can open that. What oh, does this change? Okay, it's just changing that for now. Um, we'll go. Hmm. Red and white, I guess. Yeah, sure. Alright, um. Trim colour. That's just the interior colour. Go with a, with a dark red in here as well. Okay, we can't get dark red, but garnet red is kind of a dark red colour. So we'll go with that. Right. With. That's just different stuff. Oh, you can make it look like the C8 with the Vortex generators. That's pretty cool, that. Um. Racing roof kit, or oh. I want a primary Vortex generator, what does that add? That adds them front, yeah I'll put that on. That's just, okay, okay. Right, we are actually gonna be cutting it close on money here. Um, secondary painted skirts. I'll worry about them after, just in case we don't have enough, because I underestimated how much it was gonna cost. The catches, okay they're not too good. I know that you can get a, um, it's a livery option. Or something because I know that you can get black stripes going across it. Yeah, there is black stripes, all oh, they're nice. I do like them. I don't like all these massive liveries or anything, really. They're kind of crap. I'm gonna put the these on. There we go. Look, I, I mean, I don't like how the metallic shine kind of covers up the stripes occasionally, but it should be okay. Oh, wait, is there any way I can make the roof more? No, there's not. I can't make the top bit get covered up. It's got to, like, yeah, we've got to have a glass roof. But well, it's okay. Alright, I will actually do quickly. Put blue and white back on and put my custom plate on. Right, I'm just going to start from the top and hope that we have enough to do everything. Alright, I already did the front bumper. Oh, no, I didn't. Because I was waiting for the paint thing. I'm liking that primary one. Rear bumper. Okay, it doesn't. Don't really change much, so I'll just leave it. Okay, right. Exhaust. Oh, here's where we get. That is a lot of exhausts. They're pretty nice. You can get a lot of different exhausts on the back of this thing. I kind of want the visor logo to stay there. Um. Do all of these remove the visor logo? Yeah, they do. Okay, I quite like that painted bulb exhaust. Right, grill. I quite like the standard grill on this thing. So I don't think there's going to be much change in Yeah, I like the standard grill. Right, hood. Stripped hood. That looks nice. I might have that probably because I like like clean looking stuff. I'm not a massive fan of having like vents and stuff on my hoods. Yeah, I'll have the stripped hood. Hood catches, they look bad. Don't need to worry about that for now. Neon kits, neon layout. Pardon me. Neon colour, red. Okay, yeah, we are cutting it really close on money here. But we are actually. Oh no. I've not got a spoiler on, and that is like very necessary for this car. I like the drag spoiler a lot. 
That's a pretty cool spoiler. I think I like the drag spoiler the most. Because I like the bits on the end. But the problem is, we are running low on money. So, I will be back in like two minutes when I have quickly made some cash. Approximately 10 hours later. Okay, guys, I've made a bit of money and I'm ready to quickly do the rest of my car. So, we want to put a spoiler on it, obviously. Big massive drag spoiler. And we also want a not transmission. I also want to put a quite like a secondary painted skirt. So, I'll put that on. I also do windows, limo. Wheels, wheels type. I do like the stock wheels. But they're pretty much just flare, and I want that wheel thing. So let's go flare. There we go. I mean, not all the people are a massive fan of the custom tire thing, but I'm a massive fan of it. Like, I absolutely love the car to have this wheel thing. So I'm always going to put it on because it's just I don't know. It's just nice, especially when you've got like skirts that are white going into the white wheels. Uh, garnet red looks to be the right colour. Or actually, maybe blaze red. Yeah, blaze red. Now, I don't have it. Oh, no, wait, I do have enough for tie smoke, I think. Red tie smoke? 19k? Yeah, we have enough. Alright, there we go. I've not got bulletproof tyres on, but that's okay because it's nothing that really changes how it looks. Alright, let's exit the arena. Oh, if you notice, I was just finishing off the car in the arena workshop, so because it's quicker than driving to the mod shop and I've not drove this yet um, I've not drove this since upgrading it I, I was using some other I used my Preston Mark 2 to get to my uh, thing to go to the casino and quickly get some money but yeah this thing is beautiful let's have a look at the interior beautiful, we've got the visor logo and everything we've got radio there as well That's a really nice car. What time it is now? Airport time. To go do a drag strip test. Also, I modified it in the arena workshop because it's even close to the airport. So it's going to be easier to not um, scratch up the car on the way there. Although, a bet a civilian driver pulls out in front of me or something and makes me scratch it up anyway. I didn't do the engine block. Um. You know what? Engine block looks good how it is. I think I'd probably have kept it this way anyway. So, we're all good. Because I do like how the engine block looks already with the spiky bits. Like the triang triangular looking bits at the side. And I've got like a nice, kind of squashed oval in the middle. So that's what you want to call it. Okay, that was a nice drift. I like how this car drifts. And we didn't do a horn because horns aren't really necessary. I just put one certain class. Look at how fast this thing is. Like, it is actually quite fast. And it does a pretty nice, like, spin out as well. When I make it spin out. Like, more line. Let's go first person so that we can see the speed on. Oh, let's go. Oh my god, we're going pretty fast. 102, 103, 104, 105, 106, 108, 110, 111, 112, 113, 114. Okay, that's nice, but I'm going to have to do that because we was. Oh, did I scrape it? That's a question, did I scrape my car just now on that thing? Don't think I did, that's that's nice. Oh yeah, I do quite like this like velvety effects that we're getting. Also it covers up the black lines from some angles, but not all angles, so that's nice. Yeah, it's like a um, almost a velvet effect when you get that like bright red shine. I mean it's kinda of difficult to see in this light because it's a bit of a bad lighting thing, but like, just look at this. Can it wheelie? I mean, I doubt it because it's a sports car, not a muscle car, but I mean, we can test it. 
Yeah, no, he can't wheelie. It can accelerate pretty quick, though. I mean, it's not the best acceleration I've ever seen, but it's pretty nice. I'm going to try and take this big corner here. I mean, it's a bit rainy, so it's not really accurate representation. Yep, it was rainy, so I kind of skidded into the grass as we start the corner. But I'll try and take this bottom one better. Okay, that was a bit of a drift one. Don't know why I'm thinking the highlights. Well. Yeah, I like the back fit. I like how like when you brake the entire thing comes of someone, but when you just drive in, just the front bits on. It's pretty cool. Yeah, this car doesn't look like um, to quote one of the comments on my last video. A Ronald McDonald mobile. I found that hilarious. I don't remember the names whoever commented that, but thanks. That was no, oh, that was hilarious. Um, yeah, this thing's pretty beautiful in my opinion. Obviously, you can have your own opinions, like. But, can I say it's corner? I can. I mean, I did it badly because it was a drift because of the rain, but still. That's me turning all lights on and off, and I like the red underglow as well. Oh, yeah, that reminds me I need to look at the underneath of the car. It's going to scratch up the top, but. So let me see. Is this top one going to act as a window? Yep. No, it won't stomp, will it? Unless I put an arbor at which point. There we go. You can't fall through it, obviously. But yeah, the car's getting a bit beat up now, but it's okay because we're about to flip it over, which is going to beat it up more. I just wanted to shut the door. I like how the door's open as well. Right. Oh, actually, before I flip the car over and scratch it off, so let's just do this. Uh, okay, the doors. Oh. We can get a look at the front boot. We can get a look at the sides and stuff. We can get a look at the back boot and then we can get that um, thingy there, the engine block. Just from seeing it like that. Then like how the doors are open as so. well. I like how the the wind the engine block didn't get tinted. Like the window on the engine block didn't get tinted when we tinted the windows. The top one did, but if anything that makes it look a bit better. Right, ready? Three, two, one. Okay, flipped it far too much, three, two, one. Didn't flip it enough, three, two, one. Oh there we go. Okay, don't flip again. The underside is completely clean apart from this, that's beautiful. I like that a lot. How the underside doesn't have any design on it and it's just like flat and clean. I do like that a lot. So with that scratched up vehicle, like this oh it's not even that scratched, it's just a bit scratched on the sides and stuff. Anyways, 